Time to take a look at the four things you need to know for today. Number one, Donald Trump has chosen South Carolina Governor Nikki Haley as U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations. Meanwhile, in an interview with Fox News yesterday, former presidential candidate Ben Carson confirmed Trump has offered him a position in his cabinet that includes the role of Housing and Urban Development Secretary. At number two, federal investigators are learning more about the driver charged at a bus crash that killed five children in Tennessee. A parent of one of the students on the bus says her child told her that John, uh, Jonathan Walker was speeding and asked the children on board if they were ready to die. Walker, who has no criminal record, faces five counts of vehicular homicide. Number three, millions of people driving or flying somewhere to celebrate Thanksgiving. AAA says more than 48 million people will travel 50 miles or more between now and Sunday. Today is expected to be one of the busiest travel days of the year. And number four, speaking of driving, we now know where the worst drivers in America live. And guess what, everyone? It's not Minnesota. According to a new study, they're Texas and Louisiana. South Carolina, North Dakota, and Delaware were also high on the list. The study comes from CarInsuranceComparison.com that looked at federal data for the results. Speaking of driving,